I'm Katie. I work here at Taste Made, and there's a myth going around that if you work here, you must be an incredible baker or chef. And today, Taste Made challenged me to make fudge brownies. I figured it sounds easy enough, so I can make that. Everyone loves a good fudge brownie, so when I'm done baking, I'm going to share my treats with this awesome crew. And just in case I'm not as capable in the kitchen as I think I am, I brought fudge brownie M&Ms as backup. Okay, let's bake things. Okay, I have my ingredients. I have a kitchen. Let's read the recipe. Melt one stick of unsalted butter. Okay, I love butter. So second stick, you're going in too. In a medium bowl, combine blah, blah, blah. Okay, one thing at a time. In a medium bowl, pour butter in bowl. I can do that, I can do that. Okay. Excellent form. I give myself an A. One half cup of cocoa. All right, that looks good. Half a cup, all right. In you go. Okay, what's the last part of this? Add one cup of sugar. Awesome, okay, here's my cup, here's my sugar. That's like the same thing, like same size, so don't wanna dirty it and have to wash that. And also, the more sugar, the better, right? In you go. Uh, oh, <laughs> I was too confident there. Ah! I'm so sorry. I don't mean to hurt you. This is starting to look bomb. Next step, add two eggs, one at a time. Mmm, I get to show my party trick. Boom, right? You're amazed, aren't you? In case you didn't see that, I'll do it again for you. Boom! Okay, that was flawless form. <laughs> Another one. Oh, like a well-oiled machine. Would it be crazy to add another egg? Would it be? Hey, I'm gonna do it, okay. <laughs> In you go. Save the best for last. Ooh, who's ready for some ooey gooey brownies? We're almost done. Yeah, you, yeah? Okay, let's check the recipe. Stir one half cup of flour. Um, okay, so my half cup of flour is dirty, so. Uh-oh, I'm gonna just use this and measure half. <laughs> I mean, it's not that hard. I know what a half is. Add that in and stir. Okay, one fourth, salt bay. And then until that is all fully mixed, grease a square baking pan. Pro tip, if you don't wanna dirty a knife, you can just use this as a handle. Okay. Ooh, these look so fudgy and gooey. That's good. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna make these nice and even. Ooh, look at that form. Okay, so that is all good. Let me check my oven. Ooh, nice and hot. Right, Jason? Oh, I'm so flirty and fun. All right. And I bake it for 20 minutes. Who's ready for some chewy fudgy brownies, yeah? Okay, we're just gonna bake for 15 minutes. Yee. So in 15 minutes, it'll be brownie time. Oh, they look so good. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Hi. Wow, those look perfect. And now I'm just gonna cut into them. They're a little floppy, but I think they're gonna be super gooey. Let's try them. Mm, 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 mm. No, 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 no. What did I do wrong? I mean, I followed all the steps. Okay, turns out I'm no star baker, but thankfully, fudge brownie M&Ms are here to save the day. They have all the brownie flavor with no baking necessary. Mmm, they're chewy, fudgy, and a lot better than that hot mess. <laughs> I'm sorry, my brownies were honestly a disaster, but here, more fudge brownie M&Ms. Do you wanna try one? They're so delicious. Here, try them. Try them. Try them. Aren't these amazing? These are really good. Oh, these are good. These are great. I know, right? So, turns out I couldn't make that. <laughs> Sorry, Mom. But thank you so much for watching, and make sure you check out Fudge Brownie M&Ms for the full brownie experience and no baking required. <laughs> I still have a job, right?